Hot Dog Slam Dunk Round 1. From the Alaska Aces, Brendan Kublai. Commissioner Nori Ayala will be handing out the medals to our participants. Our second participant, very fresh from his championship from the Barangay Nebra King, Sunday Salvation. From the Coca-Cola Tigers, Rappi Weave. Hasta, hasta. Or participant from the FedEx Express, Omanzi Rodriguez.
Here we go. There you go, the Hata Hata Reverse Slam from Rafi Revis. Now the audience was getting into things. Now, that's a pretty tough dunk. A Revis going from the upper end, taking the reverse, as you can see. But he doesn't get the reverse the air. He means that he may have time. May have time the air. And then he's suspended. Para ma reverse mo yung dunk mo. Revis gets a 47 so far. That's uh, the highest score. Score to beat. Here comes Amancio Rodriguez of the Express. Good. That's an Express delivery. With a two-handed slam, sort of like the one Salvation did. But I feel Salvation had a little bit more flair. But if we do the experience of this slam dunk competition in the past, they didn't deserve the later rounds. Now, they come from the beer group's lead to a hot dog. So that last run of Manch Rodriguez scored a 41. Billy Mamarillo, one of the high flyers, the high young flyers in the PBA today. Like father, like son, Billy Mamarillo slamming that home with one hand. You know, Mamarillo is really known for his power slams, and he scores a 45 on that dunk. 45 points for Billy! It's a tight competition. We're going to have the scores that we have our players. Yes. Now it's Lordy Tugane for the Thunder. Lordy's a very unpowerable player. Let's see. I was going to say that we will find out if he can power this way home. Okay. Tugane missed his dunk and he tried to convert on his uh, replacement dunk. Unflappable, so you don't see any emotions. Pero pag nagda-dunk, talagang all emotions in that dunk. See, this is what I was saying earlier. Nagmadali ito si Kablay, sayang. You know, Brandon Kablay is one of the favorites here in the dunking contest. And now, Tugade will have his re-dunk. But he was able to convert on a dunk. But he was able to convert naman in second round. Yun nga lang, hindi siya na nakabuelo, no? He wasn't able to plan his attack. And now, referee Ernie... Let's see what our officials are saying here. Yes, because his second dunk reached in time. Okay. So that's also a waste here for Lordy to get it. Sayang yan, ha? Para kay... Uh, He's... Lordy to get his score is 34 points. So now we'll turn over the defending slam dunk champion, Joey Mete of San Miguel Beer. Can he defend? This I will successfully oh! win! Oh! Oh! Joey Mente racing the roof here at the Big Dome! Oh, we got by the Joey Mente sa LA! Yes, a 360 uh, slam here from Joey Mente. And you know what? He made it look so easy, Janelle. Take a look at this! Effortless! Look at that! Very graceful in the air, Joey Mente. And you know, Joey is not that tall, ah. He only stands 5'9", and he is really sky. Yeah, Joey Mendes scoring 47 points in that one. Now here's Tubin. See, Tubin is going to ask for a replacement dunk here. A redunk for uh, Ronald Tubin of Shell. Also catching the action here, I can see Mike Cortez on the sidelines with his video cam getting a piece of this uh, Pure Foods TJ Hato slam dunk contest. Two bit. Oh, oh, that's the second try already, so... That's his second miss. Unable to convert, Ronald Tubin earns a total of 20.